Today on Weekend Business Report, how one company is helping the city of Memphis to save the environment and save money. Welcome to Weekend Business Report. I'm Ileana Bravo. Keeping our neighborhoods clean can be a double-edged sword, especially when it comes to solid waste. We all love the convenience of having curbside trash pickup, but the exhaust from large diesel trucks used to collect and transport it, though no longer spewing plumes of smoke, contain airborne pollutants, many of them carcinogenic. Now look at these trucks, no smoke and virtually no pollutants, and all at a reduced cost. Richard Allen reports. This is Inland Waste Solutions in Memphis, Tennessee. They've eliminated the diesel and switched to something else. Operating large trucks, of course, diesel was our fuel of use for many of years in the solid waste business. With the rising cost of diesel and the negative impact on both our cost and what we're having to charge our clients, uh, we were looking for alternative energy sources. We decided to go with compressed natural gas, and with that said, we're looking to both convert our diesel trucks to natural gas and buy new with any of our new ventures that we're doing along with building our own compressed natural gas stations. Compressed natural gas is actually uh, a fuel that comes directly uh, out of the ground and is a usable source coming out of the ground. Compressed natural gas is the same safe clean burning fuel used in many homes for cooking and heating. And not only that, it reduces the carbon footprint for the city and for us. We took 24 trucks and reduce that emissions by 90% uh, per each truck. The trucks that are running through our community every day are so much cleaner than the diesel counterparts that have been run in the past. So it's, it's a very, uh, the benefit is economics, the benefit's environmental, and our customers are uh, very pleased, and the citizens of Memphis are very pleased that we can combine those two into one of these city services. And according to the U.S. Energy Information Administration, America has more reserves of natural gas than any other country in the world, except Russia. So it's an easy source that comes direct. We don't have to worry about it being shipped from overseas. Don't have to worry about it being put on trucks and brought here. Uh, there's no interruptions of service. It's, it's available 24-7. Uh, this gives us some stability in pricing. Uh, we're able to uh, do long-term uh, hedge contracts. So we're able to control that price, uh, and the price actually is significantly cheaper to start with. Having Inland Waste here as a, as a new company of Memphis Light, Gas and Water is, is similar to adding four or five hundred residential customers over which we can uh, build utilities and spread those fixed costs out so again we can have that lowering impact on rates for all of our customers. Our whole focus as a company now uh, is using compressed natural gas as our fuel source. Uh, so in the, with, over the next five years, you'll see our company uh, go from 100% diesel to 100% CNG. We're going to build these stations, as you see here, at all our locations. That's the game plan to move forward. Um, we're also going to build the retail aspect of it. So we'll have the uh, infrastructure paid for by, by, by our cost savings and being able to put the retail outlets on the front end of all of our operations. That gives the general public utilization and access to stations in eight different states and at least 11 different areas that, we, that we're in. Our game plan is to continue that growth pattern and be able to deliver that retail aspect and be able to pay for it through our operations. Inland Waste Solutions compressed natural gas strategy has not only enabled the company to save money and help the environment, it has also translated into a contract with the city of Memphis to be their waste solutions partner. We share a great uh, relationship with the city and with uh, uh, the authority that supplies us the gas, uh, Memphis Lights gas, gas and Water. Uh, it's been great uh, coming together to put this project together and uh, seeing it through to the end with them. Memphis is, is working hard to be clean and green and having inland waste here now is a testament to the fact that we're moving in that direction. Also, uh, our clean and green initiative involves turning our own uh, trucks and vehicles over to CNG fuel. And these things help preserve our environment and also uh, gains national attention as the city uh, tries to create a more sustainable community. People want to live in a community that's clean, where there's good air quality, where there's energy efficiency, which lowers their cost of living and makes the neighborhood more livable. 
Uh, we're currently up to about 30 trucks. We look to be, uh, we like to double that in the next 24 months, and we like to, that all to be compressed natural gas. Uh, so we're going to service, continue servicing the city using compressed natural gas, reducing the carbon's emission uh, footprint for the city, and, uh, and be able to keep a low-cost provider out here for the city. For Weekend Business Report, I'm Richard Allen. Keeping it all clean and green. Thanks for joining us on Weekend Business Report. Until next time, I'm Ileana Brown. Find Inland Waste Solutions at 512-585-4558 and at inlandwaste.com. Find Weekend Business Report at 202-681-3770 